Hey guys, it's Nick. I'm back with another video for you guys. I got a brand new exhaust from ATM, which stands for Ambient Thermal Management, who happens to be today's sponsor for this video and who sponsored me with this amazing exhaust. So I'm gonna show you guys an unboxing video, show you some of the quality of uh, the work they have here. Um, they make amazing products and I'm excited to uh, get this on the car as well. So we'll do a follow-up video doing an install and sound clips and stuff like that. But first, I'm just going to show you an unboxing and show you what to expect if you order some. I'm going to link all their info down below in the description, as well as the tags to my car's build on Facebook, Instagram. So please make sure to hit that subscribe button to follow more. Here, as you can see here, it is packaged very nicely, taped all the way around. I don't actually see any damage from FedEx. Is who they use to ship we're gonna go and open this box up here it is not a light box i'll tell you that it happens to be a pretty light exhaust though make sure i don't cut myself There we go. Okay, overall, first impressions, it's packed very nicely. For something of this size, um, I guess they they can only do so much when packing to prevent any issues, but I mean, it looks like they've done everything they can here and I don't see any issues. It's clearly bubble wrapped and taped nicely and the way they laid it in here, I guess it kind of held itself together perfectly. Um, so I guess that's a good thing. I see we got, a box here i'm gonna assume this is all the hardware when installing this as it comes with all your hardware of course as you'd expect i open that box up upside down i bet there's some clamps in there appears to be some nice clamps in here these are some very nice quality looks like we got oh wow they even give you new gaskets look at that so we've got gaskets, bolts, <sighs> look at that, sticker, if you guys like stickers, and we've got V-band clamp and flange, V-band clamp and flange, I'm going to assume those are pretty nice quality as the rest of the stuff is here, I'm just going to put this back in the box actually, I don't want to lose anything. So that's what to expect in the box there. Here's the rest of the exhaust. It is all nice and bubble wrapped up. Oh, it looks like there's some more stuff under here. I'm gonna take a second to unbubble wrap this for you guys and I'll be right back. This stuff is absolutely amazing. They've got the flex pipe in here. This is where down pipes connect. You can fact factory down pipes or aftermarket down pipes will easily connect. This is very nice. This is just amazing quality work. I've seen the VRSF exhaust. Don't get me wrong, it's a nice exhaust, but it's just not this level of quality. Um, this is just, I just put that over that for now. It's just perfectly mandrel bent. Oh my, look at, I mean, it's just the highest level quality you can get. This is where you V-band. This is the resonator. So on the VRSF exhaust, you have two options. You have in the rear, you have a large muffler or you have nothing, straight pipe. Um, the muffler, in my opinion, is too quiet and the straight pipe is, it's not too loud, but the tone of it with the rasp and the high RPMs with no type of resonator is not good. So this is kind of the in-between. So you've got a resonator to kill rasp and drone, but it doesn't kill much sound. So you got the, the race sound for an exhaust. Um, so in my opinion, this is the, this is the go-to. Um, this is perfectly put in there. Um, as you can see, you've got the spacers pre-made on here even. This is just all super nice quality. Working our way to the back. Everything still looks perfect. I mean, look at this. Someone's taken their time to do this. I mean, it's just perfect. This is the split. Um, exhaust tips clamp right on. I'm sure you can put whatever tips you want on here. I'm going to probably end up using a larger tip even yet. 
than this to fill my bumper perfectly. But those are amazing. So here's an pretty much get a view of what it looks like laid out here. Um, they are releasing an optional muffler insert option. I don't know where the mufflers will be. I'm going to assume uh, that it's a rear type of muffler insert or even somewhere else. But um, for people that want more of a quiet um, exhaust but still amazing quality, they will be releasing that. I do not know when. But um, if you guys are interested in getting an exhaust like this, I'm going to link it down below in the description. It is currently on sale for like $200 off or something, um, which is awesome. And uh, I'll be back when I get an install video and some sound clips for you.